I'm heading to Bucha, a few miles north of Kiev, which has been a crucial battle for the Ukrainians. The city has been occupied by Russian troops for several weeks as they try to launch their assault onto the capital city, Kiev. However, Russian forces have been beaten here and is now back under control of the Ukrainian forces. So this is a Russian armour column that was stopped by the Ukrainian forces. Ukrainian forces were using the wood line in small teams to ambush the tanks with the javelin and the end law. This is where the Russians were stopped in Bucha. British weapons such as the end law have been effective in this war. With little training on the weapon system, Ukrainian forces have been able to maximise the weapons in ambushes, stopping advancing Russian armoured columns. And you don't normally see tanks this close together. So I'm quite surprised that they're really close together and bunched up rather than spread out. And that's why this was such an easy position to ambush for the Ukrainian forces. The Ukrainians have been trained by former British soldiers who are now in Ukraine acting as instructors on how best to defeat Russian armour. The skills and weapons given to the Ukrainian troops by Britain is assisting in preventing the movement of Russian forces across the battlefield. As Russian forces pull back from the capital city of Kiev, the end law and javelin continue to play an important role in defeating Russian armour in the country. The destruction is evident that this was a key battle in the war in Ukraine.